Hi Kit Club! Unbelievable, but yes, it is almost time again for the October Kit Club. Okay, so due to the fact that we only shipped out August at the end of August, um, I have made the decision to only ship October in the middle of October. Okay, so then hopefully by December we will be back on track by sending it out the first week of the month. Um, and then in January we can start all over. Now, we haven't had a travel collection for this year. And um, I ordered last year already the amazing Vicky Booten Where to Next collection. Um, so we are three quarters of the way through the year. Everybody's had some holidays. Everybody hopefully have taken some trips. Or if you haven't taken trips this year, hopefully you will have fabulous memories of previous trips taken. So I'm just going to walk you through the main products. Um, obviously this all little small flowers and all those little things will still come. But first of all, we have the cutouts, the embellishments. Okay, and this is a fantastic pack. We will not forget to send it to this time definitely not um, wonderful title words you've got all the ephemera don't worry not lots of cutting out to do for this release um, beautiful 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 elements in this gorgeous pack and then of course I love the packaging you can also use this um, maybe I will even use that to show you guys then um, another three set stencil from Vicky Booten um, there you can see the designs, they are really nice, little globes, um, I don't know what that is, but cute little circles, and then of course like an intelligible script, you can never have to, enough of these. And then of course we are going back to inks for this release, um, probably will be using these in conjunction with some of the other products you guys received throughout the year, um, if we need to fill in, either use some of the other inks or the watercolors. Okay, and then the beautiful papers. I really, really love this collection and it truly did not disappoint when it arrived. You know, sometimes the images on the computer screen looks a little bit different from what it looks like when we receive it. Just look at these beautiful butterflies. So you would probably have to cut these out if you want to use them. But look at the dots. So you could maybe just use that strip or maybe I will only use the blue remains to be seen and I honestly don't know what it is with lemons and Americans they really like lemons uh, <coughs> you know Paige Evans in the last uh, in August's release there were also lots of lemons it's very interesting to me how they um, always bring in a lemon but anyway I kind of ordered it for the blue <laughs> on this side and then this gorgeous paper um, lots of cutouts like three by four cards for journaling and just for some elements I really like this one more for the pink okay but you've also got the tags here you know you can trace them like the strips I always like these elements that Vicky puts in um, it's just an additional special interest piece of paper and the clouds just look at the beautiful clouds okay so not sure what I'm going to do with these yet but um, I'm sure you guys will enjoy working with the clouds and then I really like the script it's just like a fun font that she's used on this side the stars of course we can never get enough stars and then the street map I kind of like this with the random elements with the, you know like a layout normally it's black and white but I love this and then of course the plane just simply whooshing up in the sky the clouds in the background and just taking off um, the hexagons was probably what drew me to this paper when I ordered it last year because I do love this it's got lots of random little images just simply placed into the hexagons this paper I mean, it's already just pre-made for you. So, I don't know. I might use this as a feature, um, you know, and scrap to the left or to the right. It just feels kind of a shame to just put something there in the middle. Um, but we'll see. We'll see where it, it goes to. And I love this soft yellow background of this paper. And then, of course, the tickets. You can never have too many tickets um, for scrapbooking. Love the background, the grid here as well, but I do like the tickets. So I'll probably cut out some of them, um, but that all depends once I've opened this up. If there are lots of tickets in here, I don't see too many, um, but I do like the tickets. Anyway, so that's something to look forward to. We will, I promise you, have a great add-on list. 
um, for this release and we'll probably send out the add-ons in the next week um, so that you can have ample time to make a decision about that. Thank you once again for your patience and your support.